Okay, here we are playing another Commander Shrimp level. Um, Ceres Station Beta, a foreign person level. It looked quite nice, so here we are to try it out. And yeah, a <laughs> space themed level. This guy kind of looks like a UFO. I'm not sure how this works actually. Are, can you jump on this? Nope. <laughs> um, how do we do then? Are they kind of like these flame guys that you need to shoot like this? Nope. Well then. Oh, you use the top spin. Duh. <laughs> okay, well. Just like. The, oh, yeah, dude, that was. Just barely I managed to even get up there. <laughs> Actually, we do have a whole bunch of weapons. Let's see. I kind of want to rock the dust crusher here. It's immensely powerful. I love it. Wow. <laughs> It is very powerful anyway, as long as you're just firing on one enemy, I guess. It's not got a very wide coverage here, I guess. Although, you know, it does split up in four directions and can potentially hurt more enemies, just like that. Nice, but yeah, look at that. This, <laughs> the destruction, the carnage. Same goes for this weapon. Very powerful. Oh, I thought it would jump there. Dang it. <laughs> it's just a shame how much energy this weapon drains. Like, it's such a satisfying weapon. Like, everything from the sound it makes, like, when it goes out and when it hits an enemy, to the damage it deals. Yeah. Huh. No crystal flash. Huh. Maybe he just doesn't want us to use them. But how... How do we do this? Maybe we gotta have all three on screen here. I'm a little bit confused. Actually, there only are two. How? Okay, did I do something wrong here? Do you just gotta... What the? <laughs> I am actually stumped. I don't know how to get past those without taking damage. Hmm. Well, I'm sure somebody in the comments will point it out, hopefully. Or if Commander Shrap watches this, maybe he can shed some light on it. Well. Have a music change here. Huh. Sounds like it's about to take a turn for the worse. Or maybe, yeah, maybe that's just the music in before the boss there. And holy cow, dude. Huh. You know, maybe, yeah, we gotta look for a weakness here. This is. <laughs> this is gonna be too hard otherwise. Maybe? Yeah, this is very pow uh, potent. Oh god. Nice. And nice. Ah! Oh my. <laughs> he almost dropped me. Well, the portal almost dropped me of the goodies there. <laughs> well, that was no end boss though. Okay. Luckily we got a whole bunch of goodies there to make the rest of the road just a tad bit easier. Hmm. I haven't heard this music yet. Oh, oh, I'm so dead. So effing dead. Yeah, see. Oh, you gotta use this actually. Okay, that. Okay, well, now I figured it out. You just gotta. Well, you know, <laughs> when we had the stop sign on the crystal flash there earlier, I thought. Yeah, well. I thought the Commander Shrimp told us not to use it, like, we could use it, but we're not meant to. So that's why I did not use it. Uh, I know that it makes you invincible, but, yeah. 
I guess you just gotta... Well, whatever. Just, just whatever. You just gotta disregard the sign there. The, uh, well, actually, it's not that you have to disregard it. I just misunderstood it, rather. And we're back. Pretty much, anyway. Oh, God. Hmm, well... We gotta reset this. In and out. Now... I do not have a whole lot of top spin left, so we gotta be very careful here. Oh, jeez, I might actually have to burn my M tank. Ooh, very close, but I managed. Oh god, yeah, I already forgot about that. Okay. So, yeah, this is where we want to stand. This is actually a pretty cool room. It looks very chaotic at first, but, yeah, you just gotta keep in mind that you gotta stand in the middle. Ooh, and that is very tight. Very, very tight window. Ooh, and we're out in space, space, in space here. Huh. Oh, yo, oh, Jesus, you gotta be very careful not to move too fast. <laughs> or else the freaking lift will just go too far ahead. Well, that was, that was a nice segment. A few space bombs and some enemies to deal with. And the crystal sign flash again. Oh, God. I would like to use it as little as possible, just so that we can save some of the energy. Ooh. Dang it! Okay. Well, we do have a lot of health in here. So, it is essentially... Impossible to completely fail, I believe, unless you really, really suck. Well, okay. Another encutment territory here. Okay. Hmm. That was a pretty school. Uh, uh, pretty school. Uh, oh, yes. <laughs> a pretty cool window or screen there. I don't know why I said school. <laughs> Just my English being bad, you know? That's really annoying, actually, you know, not being a native English speaker. Like, I... Yeah, I way too often do I just... Screw up words, like... And I talk too fast and I can't form the sentences properly. Or my sentences... You, you, just whatever, I'm... I shouldn't even be explaining that, I just... <laughs> yeah, whatever. Just weird, I guess. Oh god. What? <laughs> that went up perfectly in the middle. Well, easy enough. Well, a pretty interesting boss room here. It would have been very challenging if we did not have these uh, health dispensers here on the side. Now, I guess you don't have to abuse them if you don't want to, but... Yeah. I'll try and not use them anymore from now on so that we have a somewhat fair boss fight here. Oh, and I see her trident is actually blocking off my electric shots there. Nice, one more. Well, there we go. And now that there is only one left, this should be a cakewalk. And 
done. Very nice. Very nice indeed. So, yeah. All around a pretty good stage there by Commander Shramp. It looked nice and it had some fun platforming as well. Yeah, definitely worth a thumbs up. In my opinion, so yeah. We're just gonna round it off with that. Um, I'm just gonna keep it very short here. I'm very tired at the moment and yeah. <laughs> I just need to get off this game. Holy crap, I've been playing five or six stages now, I think. Oh well. Nice stage, go Snapa slash Commander Shramp, keep up the good work, and yeah, I will probably try out more stages from you in the future there on the forum, so yeah. Thank you guys so very much for watching, and have a nice day.